Did you ever find yourself trying to get rid of the previous color point of injection and it seems to never disappear completely? Let's talk about how to clean a hot runner system and prevent this kind of situation. In most hot runner systems, we have injector tips, insert gates, and a space leave between these two elements. When a new mold is used for the first time, the resin fills up this space before going to the mold cavity. This resin doesn't go anywhere. It stays there forming a cap that within time and heat degrades and causes black specks and other kind of contamination. Sometimes clogging the point of injection and causing the cancellation of that cavity, taking your production rate down. The hot runner system becomes a key element where color changes take place. Since the resin accumulation doesn't go anywhere, the previous color is covered with a new one and so on, generating a color history inside the hot runner system. This is why it's becoming difficult to have effective color changes even using a purging compound because we end up trying to get rid of the color history accumulated on the tips. To prevent this accumulation, the caps on the tips on the hot runner system have to be removed manually before purging the machine. Another way of preventing the accumulation of material that could eventually degrade is to occupy that space with a shut down compound, a material that will not degrade and has no pigment. The finished plastics shut down compound or stabilizer will play the role as an insulator. This way, the following resin layers will be lighter and thinner, making it easier to get rid of them with the finished plastic purgent compounds, having color changing faster and more efficiently. For more information, please contact Phoenix Plastics Company.